When George became especially hard to live with, Tammy would turn to their lawyer, this guy, John Lentz. One night I was at home and Tammy called and said, can you please come over here? George wanted to get some more whiskey and she threw all of the car keys in the bushes where he couldn't find them. So he decided to ride his power more toward Melrose Liquors. And we got in my car and headed down Franklin Road. Well, lo and behold, as I looked across the highway, there was George coming back the other way. He'd already gotten the Melrose Liquors. The thing's going five miles an hour. He didn't even turn the blade off. I mean, so it's throwing rocks everywhere. And in his lap, he had a little brown sack. I made a U-turn on Franklin Road and pulled up beside George. Tammy just rolled down the window and let him have it. I hardly ever heard a curse. And she said, you stupid son of a bitch, you're going to get killed. And George acted completely oblivious to all of this. He would not acknowledge our presence. He didn't look at Tammy. He didn't look at the car. He just kept driving this power more down the highway. When we got back to the house, George stopped. He turned around and looked at me, and he said, hi, John. And I said, hi, George. And he said, well, as you can see, my wife is a little upset with me. So if you don't mind, I'm going to excuse myself, go to my bedroom, lock myself in, and get drunk. One time she took the keys from the lawnmower. They used to have a bunch of horses, and he got on the horse. The next thing we knew, we got a phone call from the bar that Georgia got on the horse and rode it downtown and tied it out front. So we went down, and Georgia so blitzed. By the time we got there, he couldn't ride the horse back. From the very beginning of their romance, there was never any question about what Tammy would do if the marriage got rocky. But if you left him, She wanted to stand by her man, and by God, she did through thick and thin, through hell and fire and brimstone. After all, it was just a man. 